Boulder, Colorado is one of the most beautiful places in the world. And that's how it used to be when we moved here. It was, it was that way. We had beautiful sunny days, 360 days a year. And that's all changed. The skyline is no longer clear. There's days that I can't even see the mountains anymore. And it's because of the fracking. My name is Nanner Fisher, and my husband Tom and I live on a horse farm outside of Boulder, Colorado. We're raising three daughters here. We've owned the farm for about 10 years and have lived in the Boulder County area for over 30 years. We moved to Colorado because it's such a beautiful state and a very healthy state, a very healthy place to live. At least that's what we thought until the last couple of years when the fracking pretty much started taking over our lives. Since we've lived here, the fracking has grown exponentially and our health concerns are growing with that. I'm a realtor. I've been a realtor in this area for 23 years. I have sold, uh, I can't even begin to tell you how many homes, but now uh, nobody wants to move out to the county anymore because they all say, where's the, where's the fracking? Can you show me a fracking map? And when I show them the fracking map, uh, there's a well close to pretty much every, all the rural properties. After 23 years of sales here, my, my numbers are dropping. We've had accidents at the well that was closest to our property. It's 1,500 feet away, and one of the containment bags of the silica burst. We feel like it had a huge effect on us. And in fact, our three girls, who were previously very healthy, in the past year, have been, two of them have been diagnosed with asthma. One of them has a chronic sinus condition now. We actually had a cat go into the vet who had a lung condition. We have a neighbor whose well water is undrinkable. Uh, but nobody seems to want to associate these fracking wells with all of these conditions. They're, they say there's no way to prove it. It's been pretty much a nightmare since the fracking started. Who knows how many other accidents have been, have even happened over just at that site that we don't even know about um, that's affecting my family and our health every day. It's, it's very uh, disturbing to even think about what's going on in, in the things that we can't see. If you feel like it's out of your control, you can't do anything to stop it, nobody listens to you, it's, um, you feel like a pawn in this game that nobody, you're disposable and uh, I, I just can't believe that I'm an American and I, I feel this way that you're just a nothing, you're a nobody. Dear President Obama, fracking has become a nightmare for our family. Our lifestyle has changed drastically. I'm really disappointed that you would care so little about the, the people of America that you're gonna put big business first and, and leave our health and our lifestyles in the background and not make them a priority. Our health has got to come first and we need change. You promised change and we wanna see it.